A car where everything we've ever learned and everything we've ever dreamed comes together. A fluid aerodynamic design. Revolutionary engine technology. Advanced safety features. Unique panorama glass roof. IX35. The incredible made possible. Good afternoon. The Sunshine Coast road toll for the year already sits at two following two fatal motorbike accidents. A 55-year-old woman died yesterday after her bike struck a tree near Kinkin. She was travelling along the Gap Road when she lost control of the motorbike just north of Noosa Vale Road. She was airlifted to hospital where she later died. While on Saturday morning, a 24-year-old man died when his motorbike crashed into the back of a parked ute at Little Mountain. Caboolture and Gympie have made the list of the top 10 places in Queensland for animal cruelty. The RSPCA survey is conducted each year, tallying where the most cases of animal cruelty were reported. Disappointingly, this year marks the fourth year in a row that Caboolture has topped the list. Cases of animal cruelty were also up across the state in 2014, compared to figures from the, the previous year. And police on the Sunshine Coast have been investigating a number of high-rise apartment break-ins. A man scaled a resort on Alexandra Parade on Friday night before hoisting himself onto a balcony and then walking into the apartment through an unlocked door and taking a handbag from the second floor unit. And taking a look at the satellite now, thick cloud over northern Queensland with the monsoon trough is triggering showers and storms. Cloud in the southeast with the trough is causing rain. Looking at the national map, showers around Brisbane today reaching 26 degrees. Also the chance of showers for Bundaberg hitting 31 and a top of 30 for Gympie. Much the same around Toowoomba with a maximum of 28 degrees for Kingaroy. And to the forecast for Toowoomba, showers likely through to Wednesday with storms on Thursday.